Hey YouTube, this is me, Zipster. Okay, I came to a realization, that, okay, well, a couple of realizations over the course of the day, right? Number one was I went to my channel and I saw that I'm only three videos away from 800 videos. That's a lot of videos. I'm like, God, you're freaking crazy, dude. Like, the only person I know that has more videos than me is North. Believe it or not, he's hit. He's going on 900, and that's only on his one channel, Nuance. And another one is Marquita Jolie, but good luck, you know, trying to get through one of those. Not that I'm saying anything bad about anybody. But anyway, yeah. So I remember when I first... Is my cat... My cat... I have a, an insane cat. William is insane. He's waiting thousands of dollars to sign 543. He ain't made a penny for me. I don't want to get off track here. Okay, so, yeah, where was I? Yeah, I'm <laughs> three videos, well, after this one, two videos away from 800 videos. That is a shitload of videos. But, yeah, I was, like, doing them every day. And then I discovered stick ham. And all of a sudden, you know, YouTube was my outlet to get out to people and talk to people and interact with people. Then I found Stickham, which, uh, you know, you can do every night and there'll be 12 people sitting around in your room and you can talk to them and blah, blah, blah. Then after that came Facebook and, and uh, what, what's that, uh, that on Twitter and all this. So you can be putting yourself out there, you know, 50 times a day. You don't sit in there, you need to sit here and do videos on YouTube. So I really started slack, and, and I, I like just wasn't putting videos up anymore because my, my need, my need, my need, <laughs> my need for expression was satisfied in other ways. It's like you know what did they used to call us in the early days of YouTube? Cam whores. You know my need for being a cam whore was being satisfied pretty much on stick on it. It's like, and then I was doing blog TV for a while. It's like. Eh. You know, why should I even go on YouTube and, you know, tape shit when I can go on Blog TV and be live? And then I did Blog TV for like three months and I'm like, and I would do like three shows a week, shows, I know I hate that word, three live chats a week, and it was so freaking stressful. It's like, the whole time you're there, it's like, I, I felt I had to entertain the people that were there, otherwise, why the hell would they be there? Like. Sometimes you go into blog TV rooms and the people are sitting there and you can hear them typing on the computer. It's like, hello, we're in your room just to walk to us. Anyway, I don't really know the point of this. But yeah, I'm going to cut back on all that other shit and start funneling my attention back to where it all started, where I all started feeling good, and that's with you guys. Um, oh, yeah, okay, that's it. Okay, I'll, t I'll talk to you real soon. I love you guys. Oh God. Thank you. <laughs> this like made no sense at all, did it? Or did it? I don't know. You tell me what, what you want to do. Tell me what you want to do. I mean, it, it's just, it's just a Tell me you love me. Send me the hell die inside. I love, I love it. I love you guys. Okay, bye. <laughs> and I'm not even drunk it up. Believe it or not, I'm just silly tonight. <laughs> but I do love you guys. You know that. This is where it all started for me, right here on YouTube. And then it blossomed into this fabulous flower. <laughs> Let's call it a rose. Do I look like a rose? I'm sure I do, or something. <laughs> my coloration in my camera looks like I'm the last. Okay, I'm gonna shut up now. I'm, I'm sorry for all this excess. Okay, bye. <laughs>